All right, this is part two of the making of Game Master Mike. As you can see, we're going to do some fan art as part of the making of and see how I build up a huge fan-made comic collection by showing you lots of details and how it's done real perfectly. As you can see, I've got a couple of sketchbooks, which I get from Barnes & Noble. Because these are like the high quality sturdy books. And I usually get big ones for either super issues or art references. And some of the books that you see here. The um, art books and strategy guides. I usually use as reference. So um, for example some character reference. I'll just get the Smash Brothers guide for Nintendo characters. And draw lots of fan art of each character. And so I'm going to show you like much of the details about me drawing. Now this is the very first um, art book I did a remake. Versus my most recent fan art book. And um, for some art references, drew lots of characters from each video game. Basically what style I use for drawing. I know it's not the best, but it's more like a um, retro 16-bit or 8-bit style. Classic 2D, as you can see. It's a Mortal Kombat. And so the references and styles that um, I use, um, they're not in color. They're basically black and white, which I'd prefer drawing with mechanical pencils. And I usually like draw lots of posters, as you can see on my wall. Got a couple of fan art posters, as you can see up there. Well, which looks pretty cool, but there's going to be more coming. And um, especially during my free time, I usually like. Um, uh, let's just say, if I want to draw one of my original stories, I. Usually do do some of this, especially and maybe add some Doria characters, as you can see. And this is not done yet. I am expecting to um, continue on with it whenever I have free time. So as you, as you can see, um, the camera that I always use is my past video. I'm using a much better iPad because the last one that I had is starting to die on me. It's not getting enough memory that I always use. And um, for some of my videos, I do have some distractions, which doesn't get in my way much. There's my... Dog sass. One right there. And one of my cats is in here. There's Uni. Sleeping with his tongue sticking out. Yeah, so, um, especially when they get on my bed, especially one of my cats jumps up there, they usually get in the way. But, um, not all the time, but I have to, like, record and work around them. Especially um, doing a long video, especially um, doing a game room tour or showing off my game hall videos, they 
usually get in the way sometimes. While I'm doing the making of, especially right now, while doing the making of, they are now well, well behaved. They're now sleeping. And um, usually uh, my closet, which is going to be well organized real soon, as you can see, it is still a um, mess. Yeah, um, basically what I'm going to do is that um, I'm going to close this door here. This is a walk-in closet, and I'm going to put a, another small bookshelf up there to, like, fit some books. So at night when I want to read a book, I can pull it out. So like this, and can read. Also, um, if I want to like play the DS on my bed or couch, I usually get it out, pull it out, and play it. Or my Game Boy. Turn this on. Like if I want to do a gameplay video, like I haven't done that in a while. Um. Usually, like, for example, turn on my Game Boy, got one hand and the camera on the other. Let's see if we can zoom in there. We're going to play some Pac-Man, the classic NES series for the Game Boy Advance. I usually do not do uh, commentaries or talk through the game while playing it. I just do it silent. This is Game Master Mike playing Pac-Man for the Game Boy Advance. And I died. Well, folks, there you go. I hope you liked these parts of the making of Game Master Mike. I'm glad I decided to show you how it's done and how I um, usually do recordings and everything. I have so much fun doing this. And, folks, like I always say... At the end of my video, about and show you about the making of my last video, I usually say, like always, where, well, there you have it, folks. That is my video. And until next time, thanks for watching.